Welcome back to the channel. I know it has been a minute, but you know how it is. Life, job, uh, and crap. <laughs> anyway, um, and also, I'm not going to cry about, but uh, I will mention it. And there is also a little bit of motivation. Uh, and motivation is, uh, I'm having a channel for like a couple of years now. I did a lot of mods to my vehicles, BMW and Alexis. Um, I got plenty of views, but I got no, no subscribers. Motivate me to um, uh, record every every single mod, no matter how minuscule, how, how small it is. Uh, I'll be glad. A little bit of motivation. You know what I'm talking. So, um, yeah, please subscribe, like, share. Doesn't cost you anything. I did a couple modifications. Like I said, I did not record it. I uh, did the rock lights. Did something up front, um, uh, light-wise. I will, uh, I'm planning on, on making the, the dedicated video to all my mods. It will probably be like a two-part video because I, as you know, I modded my GX a lot. But anyway, as you can see by the title, um, we got a new mod. <laughs> this time is, well, I did change my wheels and tires. Reason uh, my tires were uh, kind of on the end of the uh, rope, um, still still drivable, of course, but uh, I just recently uh, had a short vacation. I wanted to go see the snow. I have not seen the snow, of course. I live in Florida, but it's been probably, uh, my goodness, 16 years now, or maybe 14 years since the last time I went up way up north to see the snow. Um, last time I ended up in Buffalo, New York. That's the first state from Florida that, that had a snow that year. I forgot what year that was, but this time I went to North Carolina, a town called Boone which was a, a, <laughs> a great little town and I literally uh, got a few days of snow in Boone. We do have a ski resort up in the mountains called, uh, oh crap, Sugar something. Uh, that's where I went uh, to ski uh, and then also realized uh, it's been a 20 something years since the last time I skied so I did forget most of it. it took me a couple hours, I'm not gonna lie, uh, to get the hold of um, just a f fraction of what I used to know when it comes to skiing. So uh, yeah, enough grip to climb up. Uh, coming down was like a little bit iffy till I actually pour the salt and all that crap. But uh, the the GX was a little bit on a slidey side, you know, uh, traction would come a lot also and blah blah blah. So I was due for a new tires. Uh, While well, I'm digging in the pot, why not? upgrade the wheels too and that's exactly what I did so uh, that's the reason nothing's wrong with with my Rhino wheels uh, they were they, they were great and they are still in decent shape a couple of rock chips and scratches from you know rock here and there but um, nothing crazy tires are still in a pretty good shape but I wanted a new and improved and that's what I did and what I did as you can see by the title I downsized the wheel and I increased size of my tires my black Rhino wheels are uh, 18 inch and the tires were uh, 265 65 18 I believe 9 inch wide and uh, offset was uh, 12 this time I went with 17 inch 8 and a half wide uh, method wheels and the model is 703 uh, with a zero offset so smaller wheel bigger tire and tires are 275 70 17 um, I love Nito Ridge Grapplers that's what I had previously um, like I said they were uh, good and they still good and and I put probably 30,000 miles on the truck so um, don't fix it if it's not broken. I uh, love how they ride, they're not too noisy. So um, we are back with the Nitos, just as I said, um, size taller and size wider. Now let's get this uh, one thing out of the way because I know you guys are going to be asking, uh, do they rub? Because you know this is a stock uh, uh, 
suspension still. So, just if you can see the like a little bit darker spot right there, right underneath the, the, the spotlight, uh, just a little heat gun and push those ridges kind of in. No zip ties, no nonsense, no cutting. They fit perfectly. And uh, only slightly rubbed when the wheel is turned and I'm backing up. Going forward, uh, turning wheel forward, full left, full right, no rubbing whatsoever. Only reverse um, um, when the wheel is turned. That, that, that's it. Both sides, just a little ridge. Um, I can take it to another side. Uh, took me probably 10 minutes altogether with a heat gun and uh, no more rubbing. You see right underneath the flashlight, uh, flashlight beam, the, the darker spot, that's when I heat it up and just push the plastic. Back end is just fine, no rubbing whatsoever. Uh, clears the uh, body mount, clears my uh, upper control arm, everything's clear. Um, and I did not have any issues on the back whatsoever. Most likely because uh, I have a rock slider, so I already chopped off the 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 body section here. So the plastic, they do poke out a little bit, just a tiny tiny bit, uh, because this is the zero offset, and my previous setup rhinos were uh, plus twelve. So now even looks better. Even though I'm not, you know, too crazy about those offsets and, you know, them tires sticking up my long, I'm not that kind of fella. Alright, no, so he just took off. Finally cleaned them. I haven't cleaned them for a year. And I felt, uh, I felt bad for the guys that they were being stolen, the new wheels. Because all that dirt is going to be all over the place. So I did clean them. Uh, I might actually uh, put them up for sale. As you can see, tires are still good, wheels are in a great shape, so uh, it's going to be cheap if you're interested, let me know, uh, especially if you are um, um, local in Florida, somewhere near Daytona Beach. I did buy uh, five wheels, that's a fifth wheel, we will fight with that. Um, sometime soon try to stuff it in a spare wheel spot but yeah good luck and if you're wondering why I have uh, silver lug nuts on a black wheel it's because they did mess up my order I ordered the uh, black ones with the extended thread but they sent me the regular ones so um the new lug nuts will arrive in a couple days, so that will be fixed. Well, that's it for me, guys. Uh, thank you for spending your time with me, and thank you for watching. Bye-bye.